Well, everybody, welcome back. Happy Wednesday morning to you. Getting you caught up uh, for one final time on the peak wind gusts that we saw yesterday uh, from Cutbank all the way to East Glacier as Glacier County took the brunt of the winds in northwestern Montana yesterday up in the 80s. A lot of readings in the 80s, but even near or above hurricane force in a lot of other areas as well. Great Falls in Helena around 55 to 65 mile, miles an hour was uh, the consensus heading into uh, yesterday morning uh, and taking a look at the much less windy ground Great Falls uh, on the clinic eye cam right now. Currently a temperature of 10 degrees and southwest wind of 8 miles per hour. So for the first time, I'm seeing a negative reading when it's uh, when we're talking about the wind chill minus two is what it feels like this morning. And taking a look at satellite and radar, we did have some cloud cover and some isolated snow showers in our area. But look what happened over the last hour that clouds and that snow really fizzled out. So we're going to be dealing with clear conditions as we head later into the day today, mostly uh, 10 to 25 degrees colder right now than uh, we were yesterday and it is 10 degrees in Great Falls, 25 in Helena, 23 in Lewistown, 21 in Glasgow, 19 in Haver and 10 in Cutbank. And there are your temperature differentials right now. It's currently 24 degrees colder in Great Falls than it was at the six o'clock hour yesterday. Taking a look at your winds, uh, very calm in western and central Montana, but we still do have those lingering uh, northwesterly winds in eastern Montana around 25 miles per hour that we had from yesterday. That'll die as we head into the afternoon, but temperatures anywhere from the lower to the upper 30s, 39 in is your forecast high in Great Falls, 38 in Helena, 35 in Lewistown, 36 in Cutbank, 37 in Haver, and 34 in Glasgow. And for your lows tonight, much like tonight, we'll have temperatures in the teens to near 20 degrees, 20 for your low in Great Falls, and a little bit of a rebound tomorrow, some southwesterly winds kicking up, helping to get temperatures in the low to mid 40s uh, across the state heading into your Thursday. Winds will make their way out of the area as we head into the uh, later part of the day in eastern Montana today. And then tonight looks to be a very calm and clear night. Uh, well, we'll have increase in clouds in western Montana, but it will be uh, very calm in terms of the winds uh, around 5 to 10 miles per hour. And as we head towards the day tomorrow, we kick the winds back up a little bit in the Great Falls area around 20 to 30 mile per hour. Possible gusts, but not like we were dealing with for Monday night into Tuesday by any stretch. And we'll have uh, some winds. Uh, heading into Friday morning as well. Taking a look at future track, really nothing going on. You see those clouds already diminishing and we'll have increasing cloud cover as we head into the overnight hours tonight and into tomorrow. And as we head into Thursday night into Friday, we do have the chance for some scattered showers and some upper elevation snow showers heading into the western part of the state. Great Falls three to seven day forecast, 39 today. We inch towards 50 degrees heading towards Friday with that chance for an overnight shower tomorrow night into Friday. And we'll have temperatures near uh, 40 degrees, 40 to 50 as we head towards the weekend and the, night, uh, the start of next week. Same for Helena, chance for showers Thursday night and Friday and then inching towards 50 by next Monday.